heard in the industry that uh, having the drivers on the actual PC boards, PCB boards, can cause issues. One, that they, they carry their own weight and there's an inertia with vibration, so one, they can snap off. So I want you to tell us why ours won't snap off. I've also heard that there are uh, boards out there prematurely dying that seem to me to have less drivers than what we've got on our boards. So explain what goes on with the design and construction of our boards. Well, a couple of points we should look at with the circuit boards. Firstly, our circuit boards, we use a copper circuit board over and above the standard aluminium circuit board. That's for heat dissipation, which we'll talk about a bit later. But one of the things that we do is when we put the components on the circuit board and it's gone through the vapor phase soldering, we then put an adhesive, and it's a, a special adhesive because you have to use the correct adhesives in certain boards, um, onto all the heavy components. Because even though people say solid state, it's not going to vibrate off, with the inertia and the impact that a lot of the machines have, yeah. there is a potential for a heavy component to shear off. So anything that's got a potential for failure like that is actually glued on there with a specific glue. Now, now picture. This unit here has seven drivers, the, the larger unit. Yep. Now, at 240 watts, you divide that by seven, you're getting around about 33, 34 watts per yep. driver. Now, most of the competitors are running probably two drivers for up to 300 watts. So they're putting 150 watts through each driver. That's putting stress on the components that they're using within that. The toroids, all that sort of thing, they, they're gonna have stress, electronic stress or electrical stress. Mm -hmm. This it actually reduces that, and by doing that, you're actually prolonging the life of the components, yeah. prolonging the life of the fixture, which is better. So less it. less heat load yes. on each driver yep. uh, means that we're going to get a longer life, and that's common knowledge in electronic components. That if you can manage the temperature and have less peaks of heat and, and keep a better temperature at the life of the component, you'll get much longer component yes. life. So that's one of the reasons when you look at one of the sturdy light fittings and you see those extra little drivers, it's to get the heat load reduction down on the circuitry and give a longer life to the boards. Well, thank you for taking some time to look at our products and the questions and answers that we've given you today on technical matters. If you have any other questions, you'd like to validate some of the information, you might like to get a lighting design, for a piece of equipment, you service on site, a site visit, we do all of those things. So please make contact with us on www.sturdylight.com or sales at sturdylight.com. Thank you.